Roses are red, violets are blue, sugar is sweet, and so are you. What is up guys, Ben Sanity here, and in case you guys don't know by the intro, we're going to be looking at a poem today. What kind of poem? Well, it's not just any other normal poem. It's a poem that is said to, you know, curse you or even kill you once you read it out loud. Once you read it out loud. So, yeah. Some of you might know what, we're, what I'm talking about already, but for those who don't, we're going to be having a look at it today. So, hope you guys are ready. Let's go. So, guys. The poem we're looking at today is Tomino's Hell. So, yep, welcome to Tomino's Hell. So, Tomino's Hell. It's a notorious damned poem believed to curse or even kill anyone who reads it aloud, out loud. Sajio Yaso, a famous Japanese poet, wrote the poem after the end of World War I. Many believe he explained his suffering through the poem after, as his father died during the war. So, um, I said we were going to read this poem, right? So, yeah, I guess that's what we're going to do. Uh, see if we can get cursed or not. Uh, for you, you guys will find out eventually if I get cursed or whatever, man. But yeah, apparently this poem is based off personal experiences, which... Makes it even unsettling. Oh, there it is. The unsettling cursed poem, right? So, yeah, we know we're in the, we just found out what Tomino's Hell is. So, now let's have a look at what it sounds like. And, ooh. Well, this is Tomino's Hell, the poem. So, this is Tomino, apparently. So, yeah, we come back here. You see some images of Tomino. And, ooh, not a good looking... Nah, I'm sorry. Like, dude, look at that neck. Ooh. And you know what they say about people with long necks, guys? They're able to look up higher. Obviously. <laughs> like, what are you guys thinking, man? Huh? Jeez. I'm ashamed of you. So, yeah. This is Tomino. Um... So, ooh, a lot of creepy pictures right here. Alright guys, so let's go straight into listening to it then. So, Tomino's Hell, and we've even got a English translation here, which I will read out loud and yeah, hopefully nothing happens to me during the night. So, let's go. I'm actually kind of scared guys. So, yeah, let's be scared together. First of all, that voice is very unsettling, indeed. So, to have to listen to that is... What the heck is this? Ooh. Okay, so it's related. Okay, so... That is to that was Tomino's Hell, guys. Yeah, very creepy. But they got the right person. The, um, they got the right voice to get, you know, unsettle the people listening to it. So, now... We're gonna read it out loud in English. <coughs> Sorry. Okay. 
The older sister vomits blood. The younger sister spits fire. Cute Tomino spits treasured jewels. Tomino died alone and fell into hell. Hell, darkness with no flowers. Is it Tomino's older sister that whips? Is it whips or weeps? Because, you know, Tomino just... And... Whips. The number of red welts is worrisome. Oh, it's whips. Right, okay. Whipping and beating and pounding. The path to eternal hell is only one way. Beg for guidance into the darkness of hell. From the golden sheep, from the nightingale. How much is left in the leather bag? Prepare for the endless journey into hell. Spring comes into spring comes and into the woods and valleys. Seven turns in the dark valley of hell. In the cage is a nightingale. In the cart is a sheep. In the eyes of cute Tomino are tears. Cry nightingale for the woods and the rain. Voicing your love for your sister. The echo of your cry howls through hell and the blood red flower blooms. Through the seven mountains and valleys of hell, cute Tomino travels alone to welcome you to hell. The glimmering spikes of the needle mountain stick fresh punctures in the flesh as a sign to cute Tomino. Okay, so I guess it makes sense in more sense if it's, it's said in Japanese because obviously none of it rhymed in English. So the Japanese version probably did rhyme. So yeah, the Japanese will get a better understanding. So let's look at what the people have to say about this. Yo, dude, she's giving you huge hints. The hints. <laughs> hey, you get it. Such a relaxing poem. Before I sleep, I listen to this poem. Uh, well, I guess it, you know, some people find it relaxing. Some people find it kind of creepy and weird. So, depends on who you are and what you love, I guess. That poem, those words, opened up my eyes and I saw the beauty in the world. Now, I'm... Okay. Tomino dropping bars on Lucifer. <laughs> Get this woman a record label already. <laughs> the picture and voice is more scary than the poem. Um, yes, for sure. Definitely. I read it out loud and I died. Ooh, sad face, sad face, sad face. Dang, that bass dropped harder than my future. <laughs> I read this poem so many times out loud and nothing is... Oh, you freaking party pooper. Don't spoil it for me. Am I the only one who's wondering why her neck is so long? Duh! She can look freaking like you got a top shelf. You wanna know what's up there? See if you things at the back of the shelf. There it is. That's why she has a long neck. All right, uh, let's read a few more. I thought Tomino's is like a spin off though. <laughs> Oh, Domino's. I thought Doritos. Sorry, I read it wrong. Domino's. Do do no. Alright, this, this, is, this is the funniest comment so far. So a social, study, social studies teacher told, made us do a project about Japan and some kids chose this and played this video. <laughs> that must be awesome. That was five years ago, man. Alright, last one. I was reading the poem in my head and I came to the part where it said Prepare for the endless journey into hell. And then I got triggered. Forgot about the poem and stared at the word int, hoping it would change to, into in on its own. Also, I'm not reading out loud, but my head hurts. Okay, guys, so mixed reactions from the people who have already seen this video and read, read it out loud, obviously. So, yeah. Guys, this is. No, 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 don't say anything. This is Tomino, guys. Let's see if I can survive the night or survive till the next video, guys. So hopefully I'm not cursed by then. Hmm. That was pretty creepy. 
well not the english part but the japanese part so yeah thank you for watching guys hope you guys enjoyed it and if you guys did enjoy it why not hit that like button if you guys want more smash the subscribe button and i'll see you guys in the next one